What's going on you guys? So um today we're gonna to be talking about a future bike build. But before we get into it, make sure you guys turn on that post notification, like and subscribe, and share. So um we're gonna be going shopping soon for my bike. So this title is gonna be BMX shopping or BMX shopping. I don't know how I'm gonna title this, but I wanna get this out there as soon as I can. So um I got many also, I got many and many videos out there that I'm going to keep on uploading. I have a lot of titles to come with, a lot of video ideas to come out with. So, yeah. So, I'm going to keep on grinding every single day. And the reason why you actually can't see me because I broke my front lens. So, unless you want to see a, a, a glare of me, you're more, I, I don't know. But uh, you guys, you guys are going to see me in the next couple of clips soon. So, yeah. So let me guys and guys let me know what you guys want to see in the next build. Like do you guys want to see me on a free coaster, a cassette still, you name it. But yeah. I may get like bigger bars in the future or some new tires, but new tires and new bars and probably a whole new frame is gonna work for me because um just riding ball bearings, uh, I, I kind of don't like that. I miss riding steel bearings now. Now that I um, noticed something, but um, yeah, and I'm I'm also riding a, a cracked frame, but the frame is not that bad as long as I don't hit any stairs, so I'm fine. Um, what else? I'm going to be buying some new parts soon, not now. I want to keep on saving as much money as I can, and so on, so on, so on. But, I got plastic pedals right here. I'm on a bike, as you can see. Yeah, as you can see. And also got metal pedals up there, but I won't be using that because I don't like metal pedals. And also, I got dust cap up there. I have... One seal bearing, which is, I'm going to use that in the future when I get the new frame. And also, I have a spare chain up there, which is, I'm going to use in the future, just in case this chain breaks on me. I have right there. And also, you just saw my diploma and my hat that I graduated in. So, um, let me just show you that right now. So, here it is. Here's my tassel. As you can tell, it is it says 2018. So that's mine's right there. And also, I have a uh, extra spindle right here with a crank arm attached to it. And for some reason, the bolt stripped out. So now I'm going to have to use a pair of uh, good pliers to take them out, I guess. I don't know. But um, yeah. I guess until then, I'm going to wait. But let me, got, and guys, let me know. Should I get more BFD tires? Should I get the Shadow Grave tires? The Shadow Street tires? Um, They have some browser ones. Um, There's some good tires out there that I just want. And some, some of them I don't want. Like dirt tires, I don't. They just don't look right on, on a regular BMX bike. I don't know. But like I was saying before, well, what things should I get and what things should I get? But now I'm just thinking getting a whole new frame soon. But this time it's going to be sealed bearings, all sealed. The only thing that's not sealed on this bike I have right now, it is the it is the stem, the stem where it goes at and then the forks go. Yeah, over there, that's unsealed, but my rim is sealed. That's number one. Number two, my cranks and my back rim, that's all sealed, except for the, except for my headset and shit like that. I'm planning on going all sealed soon, I, I guess again, and hopefully that doesn't change. The reason why I had to get this frame is because of my seat 
on my other bike was not coming out at all. The seat post was just stuck in there. It was, it was just stuck. So, um, so I made a trade off basically. Person took my bearings and I took his frame. So we both we both made we both help each other out right there. He needed bearings. I needed a bike with a seat so I can ride with. So basically, that acts that honestly helped me get what I need to do and get where I need to go. I'm glad I'll keep on going because otherwise I would be riding with no seat, and riding with no seat would be uncomfortable. So yeah. So you guys will see me in the next clip. So. All right, so, yes, I'm back at the end of another video, like I said before. So, guys, let me know in the comment section below and see what you like. What would you like in the future, wise for me getting a new bike? Should I get the Colt Gateway or get a new, a whole new Sabrosa, but this time with steel bearings? Yeah. So, guys, let me know in the comment section so I get that. Or should I just buy a new, whole new set of parts? Now I'm in I'm in the need of new parts, but I'm in the need of a new frame. So I've been thinking about it constantly every single day. Should I get get a new frame or a new who or a new? Oh my god! Should I just get a new frame or a new bike? I don't know. People offer me a new frame, and I said I don't know yet. Because then some people like to charge me with that. And then I'd be saying to them, oh, I'll wait till next time whenever I get paid. Well, um, some people are offering me for free, but then I feel bad for taking it from them. Because then I feel like a piece of shit for doing that. But um, I'm not going to worry about that. I got things I want to do in the future. Going to like, I want to travel different places around the world, such as Los Angeles, California, Los Angeles, North Carolina. Let's see what else. Um, New York. Well, New York, I already traveled, but not the whole, uh, not the whole thing. But um, yeah. Hmm. Also, I want to like go to this place. I don't know. I don't know what it's called. Oh yeah, the OSS store. I want to see what they have down there. I mean, I've seen the videos on like on Alfredo's channel. They have some good parts down there. I would like to, you know, take a take a tour down there, or or go to a, like a good bike shop because the bike shop, you know, where I'm at, it's just not good. It is not good at all. Let me just tell you that they overprice things. Like you can't use their tools there. They have to use them. Um a friend of mine's got accused of stealing from there and he didn't even steal from there. I clearly watched him. He didn't take nothing from there. I I really don't understand why this bike shop is so strict about so much things in there. It was like but no need, like, just to accuse him of something that he didn't do. Like, that's really fucked up. But, yeah, at the end of the day, this bike shop, I mean, it does help you a lot if you need to pump your tire. I only go this to pump my tire. I haven't bought. The only thing I bought from that bike shop was those Eastern grips for my bike. And that was about it. And, yeah. So, we're about eight minutes into the video. We're gonna keep it going, and uh, yeah, my uh, mirror, as you can see, is dirty, but I'm gonna get that cleaned up soon. Well, after this video uploaded, then I'll clean it. I'm a daily vlog vlogger, like I said before, upload every single day. Is that when it rains out, I gotta come up with something good, and I do got good, <clears throat> and I do. Got some good videos, ideas every single time, every day. I'm never going to stop, you know, giving up. Because if you give up, then it shows that you can't do nothing. And you can do something. You can make videos out there. You can do anything. 
show what you got out there and make sure that that matches you, that you, that you want to do it. I'm doing YouTube for fun and it's entertaining and I like to see what people think about my content. Every single day I upload and why is this heat on? What? Damn, it's like almost Osana in the bitch. But yeah. Well, like I said though, let me know in the comments down below. Where should I go shopping for my bike? Like BMX shopping. What place should I go? Comment down below. See what you think. I want to travel to places. See where their bike shop looks like. And how it is. But um, the next video is tomorrow. Hopefully it doesn't rain. It's supposed to be really nice tomorrow. Like in the 60s. So that's, that's a little bit warm. So what I'm going to do is get up in the morning. Make myself some hot chocolate. And some toast with some bacon. And then go out the door for a couple hours. Come back home around like, um, let's say around like 6 o'clock or 7. Since I got no, I got no more school. Which is that's good for me. Because then I got up at every single day. And also I got a full-time job at a hookah lounge. And I, I work at the hookah lounge from, the hookah lounge from Thursdays to... Sometimes Mondays. Sometimes. So, um, comment down below what bike show should I go to to go shopping for my bike. And, um, yeah, that's it for today's video. Tomorrow's an upload. The next day's an upload. So on, so on, so on. So every single day is a video. So, um, yeah, so I'm out for the day. So, uh, good night. If you guys are up watching this, and if you're not, well, see you tomorrow. Watch in school when you wake up, or you can come home and watch out the school, do whatever. And yeah, so I'm out for the day. Like I say, comment down below. And also, like and subscribe. And turn on that post notification.